Welcome back. This week's hometown hero is positively Wisconsin. Overcoming adversity is something Paul Martinez knows all too well. He's now a business owner thanks to his eight years of service in the Navy. And his service continued after becoming a police officer in California. I talked with Paul about how his positive attitude kept him going strong when things weren't looking so bright. Paul Martinez <laughs> has overcome a lot in his 45 years. I've lived a long life in a short while. He joined the Navy in 1993 and would eventually become an operations specialist. It was a cool job, radar tech kind of guy who uh, tracks uh, ships, planes, sometimes subsurface and deals with amphibian warfare. Aboard the USS Roanoke and then the USS Nimitz, his experience would lead him to become an air intercept controller. I think everybody's seen Top Gun and there's a gentleman who's sitting behind a console who's talking to Maverick up in the sky and telling him, hey, there's two bogeys at your 4 o'clock or 260 at, you know, 500 miles or whatever. Well, that was me. After eight years, Paul would leave the Navy and apply for a dispatcher position with the Bell Police Department in California. And they really liked um, my military bearing, and they asked me to become a police officer. So L.A. Sheriff's Academy, where I attended, and I graduated in 2004. And he credits his Hispanic background. Uh, being able to speak Spanish is, um, I wouldn't say so much, uh, I say it's a necessity because you need to be able to communicate with people to find out what's wrong. And uh, if someone's having a medical emergency, you need to, you know, what's, what, what's going on with them other, other than what you're uh, visually looking at. Paul suffered a back injury in 2007, leading to his retirement in 2011. But with the pain increasing and now out of a job, things escalated. It got to the point where I got a little bit uh, depressed and uh, PTSD from being a police officer, seeing the stuff that I saw out there, um, kind of put me in a bad place. Yeah, I decided, you know what, let me go back to school. Let me do something. It will take my mind off of just being at home and feeling like I'm wasting away. He moved to Wisconsin and got inspired after an NWTC commercial on TV. I got enrolled. I got into the architectural uh, technologies program under NWTC and Sure enough, um, I just graduated this May. He started his own company and is now co-owners of Partners by Design with his wife. But I am uh, officially licensed to design houses and do all kinds of small projects. And so I got through that rough patch and, and because I think I got through that rough patch, you know, good things came. Overcoming all obstacles and staying positive, we could all learn a lot from Paul. I believe that God only gives you what you can handle. Go for it. Yeah, we have only one life to live. Really great guy there. Thank you, Paul, for your service and best of luck with your business. And if you know anybody that you'd like to nominate for our hometown hero statement, just shoot me an email at the address that you see right there on your screen. Anthony's got to check out the forecast right for this.